Great day, guys. I am going to bring um, somebody online right now. Uh, and I want you guys to listen and hear her story. Uh, here she is. Riska, request to come online, please. Some of y'all been waiting, sitting on the sidelines, waiting for stuff to happen, and it just doesn't happen. You guys have to do it. Take action. Let me bring her online. Okay, Riska, I see you. I see you, my dear. Hi, Gigi. Riska, how are you, ma'am? I've never seen you face to face. <laughs> Hello, <huh? laughs> I'm good. <laughs> how are you? Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Mr. Gerald, great day. So listen, guys, I um, wanted to bring Riska. Uh, our first time, the first time that we meet face to face. Yes. And um, we've been talking on the phone and through text message uh, since May, so it's going to be almost three months, right? Yes, yes. So the reason I wanted to bring her online is because a lot of us, or a lot of you guys, are waiting on the sideline for things to and um, things are not going to happen, especially when it comes to your finances. They're not going to happen unless you start taking action and there's no excuse as to why you don't need to take action um i tell us a little bit about yourself Ms. Riska. well i am a single mother of four and as you can see i'm actually on my lunch break i'm whoever's on live i'm just as regular as you here's my name badge <laughs> um i work at heb i have four kids and my whole goal is just trying to break that generation curse just trying to live a better life like we all are. So it's just pursuing and trying to push forward. We have obstacles. And trust me, what I'm going through right now, oh, Gigi knows. <laughs> but you just have to, God sends people in your life for reasons, seasons, and purposes. And you have to have that mindset. You have to have that determination no matter what. If this is what you want, you got to go for it. So um, Ms. Riska contacted me uh, at the end of May, uh, and initially I thought she was going to join the 100K boot camp, but it turned out that there was more stuff going on with her. Do you want to talk about uh, a little bit yes, of what's going on with Yes, I will. You? Hopefully my story will help someone else. So um, I built this relationship with this lady. Um, long story short, she ended up just scamming me, like scamming me out of a lot of money mentally physically it was just a lot that she scammed me out of and i most people would have and i probably lost i probably would have lost it i wanted to do some crazy things but i didn't so i was on ig and like Gigi just kept posting coming up on my post i'm like okay who is this lady My, mind you i don't know her so i followed her and i i deep dive we talked and through all this situation like this lady really deprived me of everything. My credit, my credit was almost at 800 and she took it within two months. So it's like, I'm starting from scratch and Gigi's not just helping me with my credit. She's also helping me mentally, physically, things that she doesn't even know that she's helping me with. And excuse me if I get emotional y'all, because like, I'm a real person. Like I'm not, she didn't pay me to do this. This is, this is real. Like I'm a real person and I can't thank her enough and her, her, just the push that she's giving me is allowing me to get my credit myself together so that I can go to the hundred, a uh, hundred boot camp and I will be going. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, um, the lady, 
she didn't say that I'm out. But listen, if you guys have been scammed by somebody, if you guys know somebody that uh, has been scammed, share this life with somebody because it makes a difference. Like the people that you have around you, like your mental state, everything, like everything right. just and then either you either keep pushing or it just knocks you down. Um, so Miss Riska um, got scammed, not just six digits. It was close to a million to dollars. A million dollars. I, I'll say it was a million. It was a million dollars. She put another the vehicle that I have right now. She put another vehicle in my name. She got a loan. It's like she knew what she was doing. And she just took everything. We were supposed to go in partners. Like I was flipping, fixing homes. I was excited. She just took everything from me. So it's like, I have nothing. That's how I felt. I have nothing. So, and then as a single mother, it's like, you didn't only take from me, but you took from my kids too. So, and as a mother, even if it's a single father, you know how you can relate to your babies. Like my babies are my motivation. They're the reason why I get up and grind and push the way I do. And I just really, y'all, you have to motivate yourself. You can't feel sorry. You say, okay, God, it's the reason why this happened. Every situation happened for a reason. And my son, he even told me, he was like, mama, you're the strongest person. I'm like, yeah, you just don't know. And inside, I'm, I'm dying. <laughs> but like, it really hurt. She took a million dollars from me and she's nowhere to be found. So I'm responsible for all of this stuff, trying to get everything fixed, trying to get everything together. And it's like, God, what, what do I do? Where do I start? And here comes Gigi. And I'm not making this up, y'all. Like, she's just helping me put everything in line, fixing my credit back. I would have never thought, I was like, I would have never thought this, I could recoup from this. But I am. But I am. I'm pushing forward. I'm speaking, listening to spiritual things, people that's negative in your life. You got to get them away, y'all. You have to, you have to speak positive. You have to surround yourself with positive things and you have to push forward. No matter how bad it may seem, no matter what the storm may bring, you got to want it bad enough for your babies and for yourself to change. You have to change it. Exactly. And listen, between Andy and I, we've offered to clean up four people's credit reports, right? Or no charge. All you guys got to do is just do the work, sign up, contact me, sign up. And out of those four people, only two people have contacted me. And the other one, I, I think I called maybe like three times and it hasn't happened. Why, guys? Like, it's free. We were not charging you anything. But so we're, we're helping is between Andy and I. And Andy's on the line. Andy, you request to come on like... Um, Andy is uh, on the line, and um, I was going to ask Andy to uh, help Ms. Risk out, but at the same time, I can't speak for her. So she ended up contacting him, and she's going to go to the boot camp. Yes. And we're figuring out different ways to basically get her. She had a plan, so her plan didn't go through. So now we're helping her pivot so she can still accomplish that goal. Right. Um, but as you guys see like she wants it she wants it and she's uh we just don't give stuff off or we just don't like give our energy and time to everybody you know like we can tell who's um who's genuine who's she stayed on my phone like she <laughs> would come um you like two weeks ago like a month ago you might not remember me but i'm back yes and she, i did like that and she, i did <laughs> And that's for anybody. <laughs> Able to see like who really wants it. There's no reason why you guys should be struggling. At one point, Ms. Briska told me, she called me and she said, Gigi, I, I think I'm just going to get another job. I did. Just to pay off this. I did. I did, y'all. She's not lying. I did. I, I was stuck. I didn't know. I was literally about to get another overnight job just to try to make ends meet. And um, I said, no, we're not doing that, Ms. Riska. You're, what you're going to do is you're going to uh, pursue this in a legal manner. So now uh, she's going through, she's trying to get an attorney. Yep. She's going to make it to the boot camp. Yes. And, I'm bringing um, my babies too. <laughs> 
So yes, yes, y'all. Yes. She's taking her kids and um, I mean, if it's happened to you guys, if you feel like you guys are overwhelmed, this woman has one a $1 million debt over her shoulder that doesn't belong to her. Not that her. Yep. Not like it's crazy and i didn't see a, it it sounds crazy yeah but i didn't see a dime a con artist they're good at what they do i was even at this lady house she had my kids calling her aunt auntie so i felt good and then it's like it's just everything was just ripped from under me but there is light at the tunnel and i'm here to tell anybody and everybody that if i can push forward whoever is on this live you guys can do it too keep the grace of god and now that i have gg and andy the, the workshop i'm going to better days are coming there there is miss riska yes. and um so the reason i wanted to bring her on board is because you guys need to start acting like there's no excuses there's no reason to not not get your credit straight and and just start taking action just stop sitting on the sidelines and waiting for things to happen things are not Right. You got to be a go-getter. You got to go get it. I, um, I, just to tell you guys a little bit, when I started off on my, my journey, I, um, I was sleeping in my car because I dropped. I was sleeping in my car. It wasn't an option. It wasn't a choice. I had to, I had to. And now I'm at the point to where I, I mean, I'm not going to sleep in my car, but if I have to, you know, because I don't know for whatever reason I will, but we all start somewhere and we just sit there and wait for things to happen. Things are not going to happen. You're going to continue uh, with that financial that you're going to continue that you're going to continue watching us wanting to not do it. You're not only going through it but you're hurting your kids you're hurting your family there's money all this time that you guys are taking the two three four jobs it's time that you're making, uh, memories with your right right it's just i'm i'm grateful that's all i can say i'm just really grateful and i'm blessed that through all of this all of this i'm, I'm telling you i was going to go insane but through all of this, you, you got to just want it. You can't think that, okay, I'm going to just wake up and all that money, everything is just going to be back into your bank account. No, you, you got to work hard. You got to keep pushing. No matter what you're going through in life, you have to manifest it and you, you have to speak it, speak it into existence. No positive, no matter what you see. Don't focus on your problems. Focus on how big your God is. And that's what's keeping me insane. Seriously, that's keeping me sane. So again, Gigi, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. <laughs> I can't wait oh. to attend the boot camp. I'm excited. I'm excited to see the new journey. I'm not even worried about the past. I left it in God's hand and I'm taking action with your help, with Andy's help to get my life back together. Yes, ma'am. I can't wait to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> this is me neither. I'm excited. <laughs> thank you. But I got to clock back into work. I still have my nine to five. <laughs> All right. I wanted to bring you on. You wanted to talk to people, so I brought you online so you could talk to people. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And anybody, y'all, connect with them. This lady is just not well, what I've noticed because I work with people with credit before, and it's not just, I didn't feel like a person, another number, another person. Like it was personal. Like she really deep dived. She, she got to know me and my situation, and she helped me. Not just building my credit, but my self esteem again. Like, if this was to happen to you, y'all, it took me for a loop. Like, I even lost pounds. I was stressing. I didn't know what I was going to do. I can't go to jail. I don't, like, I really, I'm like, oh, God, who going to watch my kids? Like, it just, it went over my head. But it, she helped me. And she does not know how much she helped me. And I'm very grateful for that. Mm. So, um, yes, use her. Y'all need y'all credit fix? I recommend 100%. <laughs> she is the one. She is it, y'all. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, so I gotta go, but nice meeting y'all. Have a good day. Bye, ma'am. Bye-bye. <laughs>